Good morning, it is Vlogtober day three. Feeling much better than I was yesterday. Um, it's Friday and we are, actually we do school at home on Fridays. So we have had a slower morning. It's also um, cereal day on Friday. So kids are picking out cereals and I'm gonna make myself coffee and get going with our day. For my breakfast, I am again having eggs and avocado. I wasn't kidding, I have it all the time. And this is just three eggs and I put a slice of cheese in between and I folded it over and then one of the banana muffins and a nice big coffee. I haven't had coffee since I was not feeling well yesterday. I didn't have my afternoon one that I like to have um, and I haven't had any all morning so I am excited to eat. So like I said, the kids have actually, we do schooling at home two days a week. So it's just kind of like a hybrid schedule. Um, this is totally different for us this year, but so far it's working out really well. I really enjoy it. Um, I'm just facilitating the learning. I don't have to come up with any curriculum or anything like that. So I help them, you know, they, I mean, they're bright. They, they pretty much get it. I don't have to do too much like teaching. I'm just kind of helping them with the work and we do like our own Bible time and I try to have like little things for Luke to do too so he feels like he's doing school as well. So I'm just gonna finish up my breakfast and then that's what we will get to. Two plus three is four is seven, seven plus one is eight, perfect, eighty-seven dollars and 20 cents. Can you help me take the laces out of these? So my third grader, you can't see, is out there in the hammock. She has to do 25 minutes of reading. So she's got a blanket and a book and she's all wrapped up in there. And then I am here at the sink. I'm, I put a little barkeeper's friend in there and I'm just gonna scrub it out and clean it, sanitize it, um, get it really clean. I'm gonna give the baby a bath. And I'm also soaking some shoelaces. Those are the ones from the Converse that I had bought at the um, the Goodwill bins. I washed the shoes, they're in the wash right now, but I'm washing the laces separately. And so I'm gonna scrub this out, give him a bath. We're not totally done with schooling, but we're kind of taking a little bit of a break. Do you like the bath? Do I love the bath? That is so nice. Can I help you? Sure. Wash his little toesies. To be honest, I don't realize how loud the house is until I take out the camera to try to film something and then I'm more like aware of <laughs> the noise in the background. So it's been interesting trying to film with everybody home. But I have one inside, the other three are playing outside. It is a gorgeous fall day, sunny, chilly, just beautiful outside. Um, so I'm trying to clean up a little bit. I'm, I don't do like a ton of cleaning midday because it's just gonna get messy again later, but I just wanna do a little tidy up, do a little sweeping, and um, we're gonna have lunch in a little bit and then hopefully do a little bit of quiet time. I was up at 5 a.m. this morning and I feel fine, I'm powering through, but uh, you know, maybe in the afternoon it'll be nice to just sit down and relax for a few minutes. I do need to edit for tomorrow. Hopefully I can get that done. So I'm hoping that Jude will fall asleep and take a nap. Usually after his bath, he gets like all warm and cozy and then he takes a little nap. We'll see if that happens. Um, but I'm gonna do a little, little cleaning, a little tidying. All right, so kids are sitting outside eating lunch and these just came. I needed some navy blue like dress pants, nicer pants for uh, Luke for the wedding. He's the ring bearer. So I got these, they're just children's place. And then the girls, I wanted to get them an alarm clock. So I got this one. I like that it's really, really simple. Like there's nothing, no crazy patterns or anything, but then it can change colors. So I guess you can, I don't know, adjust it to change the color and then the time is uh, digital and not analog. They did have an analog clock and it was definitely harder to read. So I just got this one. I got to put batteries in and figure out how to how to make it work. But I usually wake them up in the morning and I think it'd be better if they, you know, had a little accountability to wake themselves up. But Jude is napping so I'm gonna fold this load of laundry and then probably make myself my smoothie that I like to have every day. It's just, it's so good. I love it. I have it all the time. Um, but everything's kind of tidied up. House is calm right now, which is nice. I feel like, you know, from being sick, I definitely, you know, everything that I do around the house and the tidying and the keeping up of stuff didn't get done. 
and my husband is wonderful and he he does a lot but there's a lot that goes into the day so i feel like I, i'm finally now like caught up from a day and a half off so i feel like the house is reset um, and i have a chicken thawing that i did put in the refrigerator yesterday like morning ish so that it would start to thaw for dinner tonight but i just have it sitting out to do the final thaw and then i'll pop in the oven around like four oh wait a second today's friday i just remembered <laughs> today's friday we have movie night and game night with friends of ours so i don't actually have to make dinner oh that's exciting hmm so should i cook it or should i just put it back in the fridge I'll have to think about that. For lunch, the kids are having peanut butter and this brownie batter hummus sandwiches. I had bought this, I bought this years ago from Aldi and I really liked it. And I figured it would be something good to like pack with school lunches and I could pack them like some pretzels or some fruit to dip into it. And it is really good, it's really tasty, but they make such a mess with it, like all three of them. So I'm like, I can't, I can't send you to school with this. And you guys just have it like all over your face, all over your hands. So they wanted to try it today as a sandwich. So I figured that would be a little less messy. We'll see, they're eating outside. So it, who knows? Um, but yeah, it is really good. This one is just from Target, but I had seen it um, at Aldi. But I liked that it was made with chickpeas. So I feel like it was a little bit of a healthier treat to bring to school, but yeah i i'm not gonna send them with this to school all right so it is now just before three i actually was able to edit my video for tomorrow fold some laundry uh i've switched some laundry jude had a really good nap but he's up now i'm about to put luke down for a nap and give him a bath and put him down it's late for him to be napping but because we're gonna be going out and staying out late it's better for him to have a nap you can probably hear them playing, screaming in the background. So it is It is time for some quiet time. I just finished a smoothie. I feel like it's all in my teeth now. Um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to having a little, a little quiet. Do you have glasses? No. No? You have glasses. Do I? No, I do oh. not. I've already gone downstairs. Nancy's first doll was promptly all right, so I've spent some time in the girls' room this afternoon going through their clothes again and just kind of doing that final purge out of like summer things, tank tops, shorts. I have a little pile here. Um, some tank tops that Lara can probably wear next summer and some shorts and pants and dresses that I can pack away and then I made a whole donation pile and that's all in my donation bin. But this is what we are left with. These are all like sweaters and long sleeve and sweatshirt type things, some short sleeve things. I do have more in the laundry. And then pants, she does have this one pair of white Janie and Jack pants that she hasn't worn yet. And I mean, they're completely unpractical, impractical, but they're just so darling with a little ruffle on the bottom. And I know that if she wears them once, they're probably gonna get terribly, terribly stained, but they're just so sweet. So I was gonna just go ahead and um, donate them um, because they're also white and it's already fall time, but I figure those rules don't really apply to kids, right? So I just put them in there. She's gonna look so cute in them. And then she has pajamas here. And then this is like future clothes. So like more wintery velvety dresses and some extra um, like heavier sweaters and stuff. And then I hung up some more dresses uh, at the top. But it's about 5.30 now. Hi. But I also had the kids, you know, in here with me, we were going through just all the little random things that collect under furniture and all sorts of stuff. So we got all that cleaned up. Um, I have Jude in here with me too. He was napping and then he woke up and it's just, he's three months old. So we're definitely not on any kind of schedule. Um, but my husband should be on his way home. And then we have um, dinner club, like I said, tonight or movie night, game night, whatever. We call it all different things um, that our friends are hosting. And I did put that chicken back in the refrigerator. It hadn't even fully thawed, so it'll be fine. I'll just cook it 
I mean, tomorrow's Saturday and then Sunday. We're, we're not always home for like a big meal on those days, but if we are, then I'll cook it then. And if not, it'll be fine till Monday and I'll cook it then. I do have another load of laundry I wanna throw in just cause I was cleaning out their room and I found a few more stragglers. So I might throw that in. And I had a couple sweaters of mine that I wanted to wash that I don't want to put in the dryer. I just wanna like air dry. So I don't have to like wait for the full cycle or anything. So that's just what our day's been like. Just kind of hanging around the house and getting some things done. Okay, so I finally cleared out that box that was here from a couple days ago. And then I bagged up three bags of donations that I keep in my closet. It's crazy that all of this was in my closet. This is a bunch of books. I went through the kids bookshelf and pulled out a bunch that they're not really reading anymore. And this is something that I got that I'm gonna donate. But I'm gonna get a black garbage bag to put these in and then maybe for that as well because the place where I drop off donations, a lot of times they separate books from kids clothes or regular clothes. So I will just go ahead and put them in a bag and it'll be easier to carry also. But we're about ready to head out. I just need to gather some pajamas for the kids and you know, like sweatshirts and stuff cause it's gonna be a little bit chilly tonight when we head out. But I'm probably just gonna sign off here. I don't know if I'm gonna really show much else from this evening. So thank you so much for watching and I'll be talking to you tomorrow. Take care guys, bye.